Hello and welcome to the next episode. Plug and play tactical experiment with me, Magoobidge. We're at Gateshead, season three. One tactic plugged in, the very first game of the very first season, and we're not going to touch it this whole time. First season, champions, Conference North. Second season, won the playoff final, Conference National. Third season, with 14 games to go, we're second. Six points behind Wickham. We're about to play them after we play Man City in a cup semi-final, but we've got two games in hand. When those two games in hand, we go level. But if we, we, if we beat Wickham, we could take top spot with 11 to go. This is going to be interesting. Since you were last with me, you've only played a few games. We beat Grimsby 5-3 away, and then we've beaten Northampton 2-1. The last games you saw, we beat Forest Green and South End, who were 8th and 7th at the time. And now we're about to play the Leasing Trophy North semi final against Man City under 23s, followed by the big one. So let's get into this. Okay, Charlie Gilmore's out for four to five weeks. He's not involved in the first 11, so it's not too bad. So let's have a look here. So obviously, Man City are the favourites. Our team, I've got an injury. Stubbs is out and Ollie's suspended and Preston's also suspended. So, McKenty comes on for Stubbs. Is it McKenty or is it Omar Beckles? Who's the better of the two? Beckles. Beckles for his experience. McKenty can go on to the bench. Ollie's injured, so I need to replace... Or, sorry, suspended. He needs to come out. And so does Preston. So, that's my team. James Bowler, Mayunga Beckel, Sarpong, Fernandez, Tunnicliffe, Hackney, Agatisi, Curry and Brown, Sterling, Junior Hoylitz getting fit. He's nearly there. Submit that team. So, their team. There's not any one that's of note, I have to say. So, let's get into this. Team talk. Been on a good run lately, nice and calm. I've got faith in all of them. Send the assistant to do the cut. Shout. Encourage. Man City with the first highlight. Free kick gets floated in and they've scored from it. Once again, oh, he's offside. But once again, it demonstrates our weakness at set plays. He was well offside, to be fair. It's important we don't get overwrought. Sarpong's been injured. He's only on 70%. Why am I playing him? Right, he's about to take a throw. Straight to the goalkeeper. Now, this is where we're going to get caught out. He's going to lump it up. He does. Straight over to the lap. First challenge went in. Missed. Fired it into the bottom corner. Liam Delap has scored. 1-0 down. You could, you, could, you could almost write this script every time we see this. He takes it well. First tackle was... I mean, it was a missed tackle, to be fair. I need to change Sarpong. I need him fit for the game against Wickham. Brown's on the bench anyway, so he can come on and replace him. That's fine. But I want the players to show me some passion. Can't be overwrought. Even though it's under 23s, they're again. Saved this time and cleared by Bowler. Right, the players are fired up. What are we going to do from the goal kick? James. Mayunga comes this way to Beckles. Inside to Tunnicliffe. Loads of space. Hackney to Curry. Curry find, looks for Fernandez, headed away, but Bowler's picked the ball up. Plays it to Fernandez this time, gets to the byline, headed from Brown Sterling, and it goes over. Better from us. Right there, goal kick. And we've won it. Beckles has done well, but gives the ball away. And we've won it back again. Agatisi back to Brown, who lumps it forward for Curry. Tunnicliffe, Hackney. Sees Curry's made a run into the channel. Cross comes in, far post. Fernandez heads it wide. We're coming back into the game, which is good to see. Right, Agatisi's on a 6.4. Right, we've got the throw. Bowler to take the long throw again. Goes into the box. Curry with a header, and it goes wide. It's unlucky, but we're finding chances. Right, they've given a free kick away. Delap. Agatisi, who's taking this? Fernandez to take the free kick. 
takes it and Muric gets across and palms it away for a corner. Unlucky. Bowler take the corner. Swings it in. Headed away. Comes out to Curry. First cross is blocked. Tunnicliffe doesn't come to anything. Since their goal, it's been all us, which has been good to see. Brown. They've cleared it. Mayunga. Oh, he's had a bad touch. Delaps in. Delaps scores. Mayunga with a mistake, and it's been punished. They've done us on the counter. It's been all us since they scored. Mayunga, look at this. I don't know what he tried to do there. Goalkeeper should have done better. You have to say, he comes out, stops and gets on his knees. That's a blow before half-time because we were playing very well. Team talk, assertively say, you've been unlucky so far. And they have. I actually genuinely believe they've been unlucky. You weren't that bad. In the team talk, right, tactics-wise, bear in mind we've got Wickham coming up. McKenty for Mayunga. Take Mayunga off. Junior Hoylet for Agatisi. Let's do that. Shout. Demand more from these players now. Right, we've got another free kick. Hoylet's coming over to take it. And the goalkeeper tips it over the bar. Unlucky. Corner. Brown to take it. Swings it in. And it's... Oh, I thought it was in. Got blocked twice, and the second time it goes just wide. Another corner. Curry. Bowler's comp himself back on side. This no, he's not. He's off. How many <laughs> how many more times are you gonna see that? Bowler plays it back to Curry, he plays it back to Bowler, he's bloody offside. Yeah, what was that? Goal kick headed over. I thought Beckles had it his own goal. Corner to Man City under twenty threes. Cross comes in. Got it away. Brown Sterling. He's played Curry in. Curry. Goalkeeper saved it. That was another opportunity. We've had so many. Three or four. We deserve a goal at least here. Hoil it. Picks the ball up from Brown. Gives it back to him. Brown to cross it. Brown Sterling. Heads it down to Curry. Curry's on side and Curry's made it 1-2. We saw in the last episode, Curry headed the ball down to, to Brown Sterling, who finished it. They've repaid the favour. Look at that. Great move. Great goal. 1 2. We're still in it. 20th goal of the season for Curry. Right. Praise the players. No, they're now overwhelmed because I've praised them. Right. They've got the throw. Right. We've nicked the ball away. Fernandez has done well. Oh, they've scored. Oh, he's off. He touched it, so he's offside. He should have left it alone. You watch. If he left this alone, it was going in. Goalkeeper was distracted. Either way, I think it had been disallowed. Okay. <clears throat> so, I've got one more change to make. So, Joel Cooper. Oh, I can't make any more. Oh, no. Right, now I'm going to ask for demand more to these boys. They're all now focused and motivated. Can we get anything last 10 minutes to take it to penalties? Tedditz is through. Great save from James. And he holds on to it. Shout. Push forward now. Four minutes of injury time. Can we get anything? No, <clears throat> we don't. We're out. Unfortunately, unlucky boys. Would have been nice to win. Disappointing. But not too bad. So we're going to move forward now to Gates. Gateshead. We're playing Wickham. So here we go. This is Wickham. How did we get when we played Wickham last time? I've got a feeling they beat us. Let's have a look. Wickham. Yeah, we lost away 2 0. This is going to be a hard game. Wickham come into the game as the favourites. They've got excellent form currently. We've got strong form. So, my team, have I got anybody available? Right, Ollie's back can go on the bench for JJ O'Donnell. Stubbs is also back. He comes in for Beckles. Beckles comes in for McKenty because he's a better option. In games such as this, though, you have to say 
Right, Sarpong's now 92%, that's fine. I'm going to go Hoylet for Fernandez for the experience. Preston needs to come on the bench as well. Striker. All right, that's my team then. Team one change from the norm. So James Bowler, my younger stubs, Sarpong, Hoylet, Tunnicliffe, Hackney, Agatisi, Brown, Sterling, and Curry. Or do I go with Fernandez? Let's put Fernandez back in for now. This is massive. This is top of the table. This is Wickham. 4 1 2 3 DM wide. Cash Kent scored against us a few times. 18 and 34 he's got. Right, come on, boys. Team talk. Passionate. We're on a good run lately. Passionate. I'm expecting to see solid defensive work. Control that midfield and quality finishing. Play. To encourage the players straight from kickoff. This is huge. We've still got two games in Allen Wickham. We're six points behind them. If we can win this game, we've got the advantage. Right, 20 minutes in, we're dominating. 72% possession, three shots, two on target. They've had nothing so far. But we all know the way that goes. Half an hour in, tight. Tight. Nothing in this. No highlights. They've got a corner. They've headed it over. That's been the one highlight from the first half. What a non-event. Team talk. Assertive. I'm far from pleased. So tactics. Look at my players. Mitchell Curry, 6.4. Tunnicliffe, 6.4. Hackney, 6.4. Start the second half. Shout. Show some passion. Give me 15, 20 minutes. We need a win. I'm going to make some changes. Now, players are still not performing. Ollie, you're on for Hackney, who's done nothing. Hoylet, you're coming on for Agatisi because he's not playing. And up front, Jordan Preston's coming on for Curry. Shout, demand more from these players. Can we get a winner? They're not performing either, their players. It's a none event. Shout, show passion. They're fired up. 10 minutes to go. This is a game with one highlight in it. What a letdown. What a complete letdown of a game. <laughs> so, sorry about that, guys. That was woeful, wasn't it? Team talk. Calm. I'm, I'm not happy with that. Should have done more in that game. What a woeful game to feature. <laughs> I thought that'd be good. Okay, so... We find ourselves still six points behind Wickham with two games in hand. Because that game was woeful, I'm going to play the next game. One of our games in hand. Bonus game in this particular episode. Cheltenham at home. So let's have a look at the League 2. So Cheltenham are currently sitting 15th at the moment. So this is going to be quite a difficult game. Match preview. So look at the players I've got out. Agatisi is suspended. Tunnicliffe is suspended and Gilmore's out. So, some changes. So, with that, Ollie comes in for Tunnicliffe. Robson comes on the bench for Tunnicliffe. And then Agatisi's out, so Hoylet comes on for Agatisi. And then Agatisi comes onto the bench, and he's replaced by Cooper. So, team, James Bowler, Mayunga, Stubbs, Sarpong, Fernandez, Ollie. How is he rated? Robson's better than Ollie, but I'm going to go with Ollie anyway. Ollie Hackney, Hoylet, Brown, Sterling, and Curry. Here we go. Hopefully, we get some action on this one. They're playing 4 2 3 1 wide. To be fair, Wickham played the same, but they played very defensive. It came up, they were pleased with a draw. All right, come on, lads. Let's win this. Got faith in you. We win it, we go back to three points. Play. I'm not going to shout straight off the back because so I've just done it in the changing room. So they've got the free kick, they take it, and they scored from it. They have scored. They're 1-0 up. We've conceded in four minutes. Not ideal at all, this. Not ideal. Markings atrocious. One down after four minutes. Can you believe it? No, he's not off. I think Sarpon played him on. Right. I'm going to ask him for passion. Sarpon with the, with the ball. Plays it up to Hackney, gets it back. Stubbs. Long ball over the top for Curry. 
Flicks it on. Hoylet's done well to collect the second ball. Oli inside to Brown Sterling. Fernandez shoots, hits the crossbar. Saved. Do you get the feeling this is going to be one of those days? I'm having that feeling big time at the minute. 20 minutes gone. Disappointing so far. As we approach half time, nothing else. Player ratings are, are woeful. 6.4, 6.3s everywhere. Bowler with a throw. And we've scored. Stubbs, the centre half, who scored his fifth goal of the season. All five have been similar. He's made it one all just for half time to level things up. And now we've got a chance to go again, second half. Keeper should have saved that, but we're not mucking about. We're not going to complain. Right, team talk aggressive. I'm happy with your performance. Defence, aggressive. I'm disappointed with your, your efforts. And midfield. Get out there. Demand more from them. I want a reaction from my players. Boilet 6.4. Fernandez 6.3. They've got another free kick, which they head over. They've got 10 minutes to sort themselves out. The two wingers are not performing at all. Hold on a minute. Let's have a look. Fernandez, you can swap with Hoylet. See if that makes any difference. Show passion to these players. They're now fired up. 20 minutes to go. They've got another free kick. They're going to score, aren't they? Great save. Blocked and cleared. Well, we've got to change this. Hoylet's on 6.2. Joel Cooper comes on for Hoylet. Cranston, the youngster, coming on for Fernandez. Jordan Preston for Brown Sterling. That's what we're doing. One all. We can't afford to drop more points. Push forward. Five to go. We're going to drop points again. We have. More drop points. Look at that. We had a chance to close the gap. Not good enough. And we've blown it. So we're five points behind with one game in hand. What an opportunity that was. And we've thrown it away. Absolutely thrown it away. If you've enjoyed the video and like the bonus episode, the, the bonus episode, the bonus game, then smash that like button for me. And then subscribe to the channel and hit the bell for notifications to make sure you're notified when my videos come out. Six o'clock every day. The plug and play tactical experiment. Going great so far. Are we going to throw this away in the season? I hope not. I really, really hope not. Next episode, you're going to see us play Yeovil and Cambridge at the end of March before we finish with Crawley and Crewe. See you tomorrow.